A good brand identity really helps you with, connect with customers, it helps build engagement, and importantly, it says to the world, uh, we're here. They're the things we use to navigate the brands we love. Okay, because part of this, what, what we're talking to you is, of course, MasterCard, even though it is in the headlines <laughs> for another reason today, but MasterCard, the na it spent 20 months to do what? I'm assuming it just consulted people around the world. If well, we took the name, would you recognise this as us? Ah, well, it's an important step in the evolution of the MasterCard brand, the MasterCard identity, because, of course, uh, MasterCard now has to work on a huge range of digital devices. It uh, has to work on a very big screen. It also potentially has to work on something as small as an Apple Watch. So that's interesting. Is this all about being uh, ready for the digital? Yeah, I would say, uh, yes, Aaron. I'd say it's partly about being fit for purpose for the digital yeah, age. Right. But it's also, I think, a, a broader thing too. There's probably two other things in there. One is, of course, MasterCard is more than just the, the logo that appears on your bank card. Yeah. It's a global payment system, and so that gives them the opportunity to tell that story. Just very quickly, oh, yeah. it, it's, it's, very quick. it's not fair. You know, we look at all these, and they all had, have, have had their names in the past. You can't start... A new company just with a logo, right? right? You need the name of the company. Very important point, which, of <laughs> course, these brands have managed to do this because they've spent a long time or a sufficient period of time building up their brands and building the global recognition that enables them, once you get to this position, to be perceived as truly iconic. Yeah. And I don't want to take you out of a job, but how do you, how do you choose that? How do you choose a great logo? OK, well... It's a creative exercise. Uh, I might start by pay, paying a good agency. Of yes, of course, you say that. <laughs> but nonetheless, <laughs> I think there are some guidelines, some parameters, especially today. I mean, one is uh, you need something that acts as an effective identifier, as an effective badge. That's uh -huh. really important. I think, two, if you can get an idea in there or, or stand for something, you know, uh, the positivity and the just do it aspect of Nike or the transactional element of the, of the MasterCard uh, logo, that's great. Uh, if it works at all sizes, that's incredibly important too. And of course, um, supported by a fantastic graphic system. And many of the brands that we, that we talk about will be supported by brilliant design and, and brilliant execution. And all of that together, along with all the other things that make a brand, build the identity and the recognition.